Good morning, fellows, fellas. How's everybody doing? I hope you guys are doing good and enjoying your day. It's a uh, Eid day. It's a uh, Eid day, and I don't know what is Eid day because uh, last year I had so much fun. I cooked a lot, but this year it is something different, and of course, the refugee life. So I don't have anything. So where I am? I am in front of the Domino's Pizza, but it is not the case because I took this place to talk with you. Wanted to make this video because I have something to discuss, to share with you. Well, uh, it's about opening a bank account here. Uh, of course, it's not... Uh, my, I have told you before that I am holding dual citizenship and it is kind of like, you know, a confusing and conflict situation everywhere wherever I go they don't recognize my status because um, no matter how much uh, uh, my Ukrainian documents somehow they don't count because my passport is from Bangladesh and my Ukrainian passport is e-documents so they don't accept electrical electronic passport because my passport procedure could not come I could not complete because of this war situation so when I was asking to give me the my passport or some kind of document to show that I am also a citizen of Ukraine but uh, Ukrainian embassy said that you need to go to Kyiv and then get the paper from there and get your passport from there which is not possible Yes, of course it's not possible. So, the after all this hassle and everything, finally I was able to register myself in Netherlands. Uh, I got my uh, social security number, but uh, to get the facility and to open a bank, uh, get the facility, I need a bank account. Of course I need. And there are a lot of banks that are giving services for the Ukrainians but they are saying that you need to have a Ukrainian passport and they are not accepting my... Um, uh, there are... In, I don't have international Ukrainian passport but I have an uh, internal passport or which I can say that residence permit so they don't accept it here. Different different banks have different different criteria first I went to another one of the renowned bank and they said that okay fine um, let me show show me your documents and then they reject it okay okay so me I asked municipality they said that some bank there are a lot of banks who will accept your documents so I went to second bank and when I was trying to register myself they said that you need a Dutch number okay after so much hassle and everything, I finally got that number. And to open a bank account, I still I came here. It is far away from the place where I live, so I took bus and came here. Today was I was so sure that okay, finally I was able. I am going to able open my bank account because it takes also seven to eight working days to open the. Couch. Yeah. So okay, I was finally ready to open the account. I came here and then um, when I said that everything, she said that okay, you are from Ukraine. Yes, we are from Ukraine. I gave my documents and then she said, no, oh, I will accept your passport. Okay, I gave her my passport and they she scanned it and. She said that your passport procedure is incomplete. What the fuck? My passport procedure is completely incomplete. She don't get any data from there or maybe... I don't know what's happening. She said that go to the main branch to check out your document and everything. I said, what? Again, like from... Here is one thing, I went to the main branch before and they sent me here. And then again from here they are saying you have to go to main branch, blah blah blah. And this is kind of so much hassle which I am dealing with last two weeks and I'm completely tired that today is my eighth day and this is again happening. Again happening just because of one bank account. I mean 
seriously just to open because in ukraine it was there was a lot of processing but that was instant process you just submit your document because i remember that when i was a student i did not have any documents but they opened my account they had the service that open uh, i can put as a student i can open an account even uh, here because of uh, refugee uh, they have opened uh, a, a special program for refugees and now they are denying that they only accept those uh, passports which are showing their system what is happening here i have no idea and i'm so pissed off now and again i have to go back to the city center and i have to check uh, i have to go back and i have to go to the main branch to see what's going on this is my eighth day i'm so pissed off to be honest but anyway i have to finish the work so just wanted to tell you these details and yep it's not a good life all i can say it's not a really good life because this is so much hassle and my um this month march uh, april one the payment i should have got from the government it is no i'm not getting that i'm not getting that so i don't i am not getting any service from government until i can i won't op i don't open my account or until i i open my account so then this is it this is i want to share so happy eve everybody and i will see you on my next vlog